Hello. In this tutorial, we're going to look at the muscles of the eye. And this is a left eye. And so this is the lateral view of the eye. This is the medial view of the eye. So if we look at the eye head on, we're going to see four straight muscles or rectus muscles that surround the eyeball. And of course, at the top, we're going to have the superior rectus muscle. If we have a superior rectus muscle, then we must have a, yes, inferior rectus muscle. So this is the inferior rectus muscle. Then we have a lateral rectus muscle. And if we have a lateral rectus muscle, well, we have a medial rectus muscle. And the actions of the uh, superior, inferior, lateral, and medial rectus muscles are pretty straightforward. The superior rectus muscle is going to pull the eyeball up or superiorly. The inferior rectus is going to pull the eyeball down or inferiorly. The lateral rectus muscle is going to abduct or abduct the eye. And the medial rectus muscle is going to adduct the eye or look toward the nose. But then we have these two oblique muscles. We have the superior oblique muscle at the top. And if we have a superior oblique muscle, well, we must have an inferior oblique muscle as well. Now their actions are a little bit different and a little contrary to what you might think. If we look at the superior rectus muscle and we look at how it's attached, when that contracts, and by the way it goes through this little pulley here called the trochlea, okay, and that's something you want to remember, the trochlea, again that acts like a little pulley, um, but the uh, superior oblique muscle, the way it's attached, is going to Number one, it's going to rotate the eye. It's going to rotate it in a counterclockwise uh, fashion here. So that's going to be medial rotation. But it's also going to make the eye look down and out. Okay, so we're going to look down and out with medial rotation. Now the inferior oblique, let's take a look at that and how it's attached is going to do the opposite. So when that pulls, that's going to rotate the eyeball in a clockwise formation. And so that's going to be lateral rotation. And it's going to pull the eye up and out. So again, the superior oblique is going to pull the eye down and out. And the inferior oblique up and out. Okay, so now let's take a look at innervation of these. Now I have another video uh, that you might want to check out that uh, gives a, a kind of a fun mnemonic. Um, well, I don't know how fun it is, but it is a mnemonic to help you learn um, the innervation of the different eye muscles. But uh, let's go around to the back. And um, so here's the optic nerve. And here's a little portion of the skull uh, that it's going through, the optic canal. And um, this first muscle here that we're going to look at is the superior oblique. The superior oblique is going to be innervated by the trochlear nerve. Now remember I said this little uh, structure right here is called the trochlea? Okay, so that might help you remember that the nerve that innervates the superior oblique is the trochlear nerve. Okay. And then if we go to the lateral rectus muscle, the lateral rectus muscle is going to be intervated by the abducens nerve. Now remember I said when the muscle contracts it's going to abduct the eye or abduct the eye. So that's a way to remember too that the abducens nerve abducts the eye. Okay. Now the rest of the eye muscles are going to be innervated by 
the oculomotor nerve, the superior rectus, inferior rectus, and medial rectus are all innervated by the oculomotor nerve. And I hope this helped.